What's going on guys and welcome back to the 2024 Maumee River Walleye Run Series. In today's video we're going to be headed back down to Buttonwood again today. Um, the water level did come up a little bit uh, since my last video. Um, I think my last video it was just over 582. We got a little bit of rain that has caught up and now the river's sitting at about 583, 583 and a half, um, which honestly 583 to 583 and a half is probably my favorite water level to fish um, at Buttonwood because when it's any lower than that, I find myself the drift is just a little more snag prone, a little bit too slow. Um, and it's when, it, when it's any higher than that, I find it to be a little too fast and just hard to fish. So 583, 583 and a half to me is that perfect sweet spot. Um, once again, as same with the last video with the cool nights that we've had going into today, really don't know what to expect. Could just be a mixed bag again today, you know, suckers, buffalo, possibly some walleye left in there. Um, and still maybe even my first white bass. I haven't caught my first white bass of this year yet. So yeah, I don't know. We'll just have to see. So, uh, see you guys when we get down to the river. Fish number one sucker about two casts in. Sucker number two. Sucker number three, it's been a little bit.
sucker number four. Sucker number five. Sucker number, I believe this is six.
sucker number seven. Took forever to get this one in because it was snagged. that is going to do it for today's video honestly another really good day out there today um started off kind of slow so i got my first fish uh second cast that first sucker and then i got another sucker like another within 10 casts and then there was a period in there for a long stretch that i just wasn't getting anything um so i ended up moving after a while like literally i don't know 10 20 feet to my left and when i moved over um that 10 20 feet just that little bit is when i got the rest of my fish for the video so yeah, it's, it's just crazy how that little bit of an adjustment, um, moving spots just a tiny bit can be the difference between barely getting any fish and getting into a bunch of fish. So um, yeah, a lot of fun today though. I think I finished with about seven, eight suckers somewhere in there. And then I did get that one walleye in there, which was really cool to see because honestly, now that we're pretty much at the end of the run, I don't really go out there and expect to get a walleye. It's just really cool if I can have one thrown in there. So um, yeah, other than that, still no white bass for me yet. I was honestly surprised. I thought today would be the day that I maybe have one mixed in there with the water level rising up a little bit, but yeah, I don't know. Still no white bass for me, but um, the good thing is we do have some really warm weather coming and some warm rain will be mixed in there too. And I would say over the next week, we'll start seeing the white bass come in. And then in about two weeks, I bet you that river will just be full packed in with those white bass. So um, yeah, but anyways, for today's video, that is going to be it. Um, as always, if, if you guys have been enjoying this series, really appreciate it. If you could go ahead and like the video, comment down below, let me know how the fishing's going for you guys. And other than that, just subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching, guys.